Hey everybody, how's it going? Chris from Wicked Repairs here. I have an old infield machine here and uh, it's not starting, not turning over. So I'm going to show you real quick how you can diagnose um, an issue with the starter solenoid or relay, whatever you want to call it, and how to test it with a test light. So if you know your battery is good, the machine's not starting, one of the first tests you want to do is check the relay. So I have a test light, simple test light. And I got it hooked up to the ground of the ground post of the battery. And we're going to go to the relay. You should have power on the wire that's coming out of the battery, of course. Okay. Now, what you're going to want to do is turn the key with that test light on here. And the light should turn on. And if it doesn't, then you're not getting power through the solenoid itself so we have power on this side turn it this way so you can see the light and on this side we don't I'm going to turn the key now nothing no power so another thing you can do is take a pair of pliers and touch those two terminals together and see what happens When you touch those two together, positive and negative on your starter relay, starter solenoid, whatever you want to call it, um, that's a telltale sign that your relay stuck and is no good, it needs to be replaced. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed this quick video on how to diagnose and check your starter relay.